Eight and eight, turn right heading two five zero. Vector for the ILS. Advise information. Kilo at Olympia. Heading two five zero. Vectors for the ILS. Let you know we have uh, information at Olympia. Yep. Five four zero. Wind one five zero at four. Visibility one zero. Ceiling seven hundred broken. Temperature is zero seven. Two point zero three. Altimeter three zero one nine. -er. Protect ILS approach, runway 17 in use. Use caution for bird and possible coyote activity on and around the airfield. Provide the initial contact. You have information. Kilo. Kilo. Olympia Tower information. We'll see what they do. Alright. So we've got 111.9. On the ILS, okay? Yep. Okay. Approach course is going to be 176. Fox, 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 can you take 7,000 for a final for direction of flight? And uh, I'm going to pull you, I come down to 2,400. I'm going to 3,000 right now. I come down to 407, and then I'm going to climb to 1,400. Then climb to 5,500. Uh, uh, 8908, nine miles from Wuma. Correction from Opoyu, turn left heading 210. Maintain 3,000 to establish on the localizer. Cleared ILS, runway 17 approach. Heading 210, maintain 3000, cleared, ILS 17. 758, all right. Number 13, Yankee Victor, turn left heading 050. Now I got it in intercept mode. Number 3, Yankee Victor, oh. turn left heading. Now I want to go back to this. I'll go over your step. Okay, you're going to tune that up? Perfect, thank you. Traffic in the area. If there's traffic being approaches into Tacoma, there's a. Uh, All right, now let's switch this over. Traffic, and the now I'm just and doing this on course. I'm going to switch the CDI back to GPS, and I'm going to select intercept. Now it's going to it's going to intercept this for me. It wants me to bring me to this track here, and as we're going. I'm at 3,000. It's going to now... So, if we're more than a mile from the course line, or half mile from the course line, and we input in intercept, it'll pick an angle, and it'll bring us in and intercept, and then it'll, it'll track the course for us. And so now, it went back to track. It went from intercept to track. Once it's, it knows where it's at, it automatically did that itself. It'll automatically do that itself. Yep. So we have the turbulence here. Yep. No clutch slip. No clutch slip. <laughs> It'll fit as well. All right. We got two of them going. That one. And then, actually, this is going to become primary. I'm going to leave this in the, the GPS it's so that. 758908, contact Olympia Tower. Or Olympia Tower. 758908. We are from Apoyu, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2, 7.2
cop coming up on this yet, but I've got this. That's our primary. But this is going to help me track on this, is what it's going to do. Light path on the 25 you're saying? Uh, glide path is going to be on here. So which one were you not getting it on? On these. All right, okay. Got because it. I've got it as a, as a, uh, a, a GPS. Okay. Which is what it is. This is a GPS only autopilot. I'm a little glide path. Go back. Oh, it came in. Did a little bit. Take the vertical nav off. Now I'm going to let it horizontally, and I'm going to use the throttle. And a little bit of pressure, I got my hand underneath the yoke. I'm not hanging onto the outside edges. I've just got it right in the middle of the bottom. And that's where I pull it because when I got my hand out there, I tend to turn. Oh, okay. This is my primary on this one. Because uh, I'm not on a green needle. With a with a with a uh, ILS approach programmed in, it wants me to switch it. It doesn't do it automatically. What's that? It doesn't do it automatically? It did, but I switched it back. Okay. Because this won't track, it won't track a, uh, a VOR, a, a, uh, an ILS. Yeah. The airfield for incoming IFR traffic. Yeah, clear at uh, special EFR, we'll say three east. Uh, but he's going to stay three miles this way. There's a helicopter above the clouds. No vertical guidance out of that. Uh, is there a glide slip over there? No, there is not. Okay. Because this is an ILS approach. Okay. That's where this is primary. And this is legal to fly this way. Because I've got the ILS I'm following. I'm just having the GPS do this for me. Look for that damn off leg we keep showing up. Let me tell you, I'm right there. Right. Where to pull you? That's the uh, 8 9 or 8 Roger, runway 17, cleared low approach. Traffic will be a helicopter transitioning from north, friction from south to north, three miles east of the airfield, altitude in case 2000. Clear for low approach, look at our traffic, 758 9 8. So now I'm using the throttle to keep myself at about 500 feet, I'm just slightly above. And the, and the autopilot is tracking the course because it's a GPS derived course. On this approach, it, it won't give me a glide path because it can't calculate one from a, a, an ILS uh, approach. If I was on the RNAV, it would give it to me. That helicopter's over there. So I'm looking for it. I got him on the map, but I don't see him. Okay. I gotta keep that ball centered. That bring me back. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Fox Trot maintain VFR for exchange to prove how to stay flight. Uh, good day. Thanks for the help. Six nine Fox Trot. All right. One thousand five hundred. Looking for four zero seven. I got my follows up because I can't see the runway. <laughs> we're going to go right through. A we're going through the clouds. Good day for this. Great day for this. One thousand. Look at four oh seven. Hi. 
Pulling some power, push through down just a little bit. Legally, I have to disengage. Now we fly by hand. Oh, there's the runway. I see it down there. All right. We climb up to 1,400. There's the runway. I can see it. We're gonna go missed. GPS missed approach. This is the 89 or 8 when able to request flight conditions to include bases and tops. Tops are 1,100, bases were about 700. This is the 89 or 8, Roger, appreciate it. Contact Seattle departure. Or departure, 758 Yeah, departure, 758 climbing 1,500. 758 cell approach side then, say request. 758 we'd like to get vectors for the RNAV 17 back into Olympia for full stop. Nunnery, you're under contact one mile south of the Olympia Airport. You can expect that. Remember to send five eight nine. Oh, you yeah, haven't changed anything, so I'm climbing to five thousand five hundred. I got the blue, so I'm still tracking off of the GPS, flying this pattern. If I switch it to G5, because I'm in tracking, it should still follow. Seven five eight nine or eight. Turn left heading zero four zero back to RNF. Final approach course. Heading zero four zero. Seven five eight nine eight. I'll move that for you, Sam. I did not do that. Seattle yeah, approach November 105 uniform. Say again, direct what? Direct Yisu, sir, the intermediate fix on the ILS 17 approach. 